Hey everybody, Massachusetts Prepper here. Today we're going to talk boxes for your bees. So today we're going to talk about the two different types of boxes I use in my apiaries. The first one is your standard brood box. Now this box is nine and a half inches deep. It holds a deep frame and there will be ten of them because this is a ten frame brood box. Some people run nine frames but they space them out so the bees build the um, comb thicker. That way it makes it easier to uncap. Normally you can run one of these on the bottom, place another one right on top of it, and that would be considered the brood chamber. That's where the queen would lay in both of those boxes. Some people just run one of these and then put a queen excluder on it and put their honey supers on. And the queen does everything she needs to do, laying all of her eggs to raise her brood right in this one box. I typically use two. Now the second type of box is a six and a half inch deep or six and three quarter inch deep honey super. This holds a medium frame. The box itself is six and three quarter inches and this would typically set on top of your brood box with a queen excluder or not. The bees would fill all the frames in here with honey. I'll show you how that would set up. Now in a typical hive setup you would have two brood boxes, then you would place your honey super right on top. Some people run just one of these brood boxes, then put a queen excluder in, and the honey supers then build up on top. I'm going to try it a couple different ways this year. I'm going to be running my standard two deeps, or brood boxes, then a queen excluder, because I don't want my queen laying eggs up in my honey supers. Some people don't mind that and they don't mind you know moving stuff around to accommodate the queen but I'm going to have a queen excluder and then I won't have to worry about any frames that might have brood in them in my honey supers. So this is typically how I set things up in my apiary I will be trying some different strategies this year using just one brood box and then going with my honey supers, but I will still maintain some double brood boxes with honey supers on top. In a future video, I'm going to show you a complete hive setup and everything you need to get started in beekeeping so you'll have all the information you need. Will you survive whatever comes your way? If you have all the bee equipment you need, you just might. This is a Massachusetts Prepper saying, take care all.